don't pick that life, that life picks you. Welcome to Sit Down News, and before I begin, I'd like to mention our sponsor. This video is sponsored by Ratchet Clothing. Go take a look and check out their newest styles. I hope everyone's enjoying their day today. We have another prison story to tell. Prison is a petty environment. A lot of people don't know that. They argue over the most ridiculous things. And one of the things that people argue about in prison is over the TV. The phone as well, but the TV a lot more. So when this story was told to me, I wasn't surprised at hearing it because I've seen it time and time again throughout my 17 years. There was a time I remember when a guy got stabbed, almost lost his life over a seat by the TV because someone was sitting in the seat. I think back at a lot of things that happened in prison and a lot of things I've seen and I shake my head. Although this story I wasn't there for, it was told to me. The person who told me the story was Big John Castellucci, who was my captain at the time. So Big John despised John Gotti Jr. He didn't like him. Anytime his name came up, he had nothing but bad things to say about him. He had told me a story that they were away together, and I believe it was in Raybrook, which was a medium security prison near Lake Placid. It was originally used for the Olympics, but then turned into a federal prison. Anyway, Big John was into TV and movies a lot. He would always be talking about the latest Homeland or Breaking Bad episodes. Well, while he was in prison, the latest show out was The Sopranos. And John said whatever night that The Sopranos aired, I believe it was Sunday nights, he would go get the TV and a bunch of guys would watch it. So one night he goes over to get the TV to get ready for the show. And who's sitting there watching TV but John Gotti Jr.? And he happened to be watching a different channel. So John said he went over to him and said, listen, Mo, we're getting ready to watch The Sopranos. We're going to change the channel. So John Jr. said to him that whatever he was watching, he wanted to watch that. And he basically told John that he don't watch The Sopranos because they're talking about the life. Now, at this point in time, Jr. is an acting boss for the Gambino family. And John's just an associate for the Lucchese's. So Big John said he was pissed off. He didn't like the way Jr. answered him. And he said to him, listen, I don't care what you don't like. We're watching it. As I mentioned, this story was told to me, but according to Big John, Junior stormed off like a little girl. So I asked him, then what happened? He looked at me and laughed. He said, nothing happened, Mo. We all watched The Sopranos. The ironic part, or the greatest hypocrisy, is that in 2015, Junior published a book. So here you have this acting boss who don't want to watch a show because they're talking about the life, Yet, years later, you go and publish a book about the life. Makes no sense. Then, in 2018, he becomes fully involved in the production of a movie about his father and the life. People truly don't know how hypocritical that life is. I've seen guys badmouth someone for whatever reason and then do the same exact thing. I know the story demonstrates Junior doing this, but it's not only him. It was everyone in that life. If you enjoyed this video, you can hit the like button if you want. I appreciate those who have. I also want to thank everyone who subscribed to this channel. If you have not subscribed and you would like to, you could do so down below. I have a really good interview coming up next week. I think everyone's going to enjoy it, so stay tuned for that. All right, ciao. You can subscribe to the Sit Down News blog at sitdownnews.com, and I appreciate everyone who has subscribed. Thank you. Well, just another example in the mob you never knew about. Hope you enjoyed the story. If you would like to subscribe to this channel, you could do so down below. If you would like to subscribe to my other channel, Unlimited Substance Podcast, I'll add a link in the description for this video.